So, like I said, we're just going to have fun today. I'm going to show you how I do them. <clears throat> As I stated on my listing, if you want to go ahead and order, please do so at Amy Rose Crafts, Amy Rose Crafts .etsy .com. Um, They're decorative. These are no means. They're non-medical. These are like the mums that I make. They're for decoration. They're for just, you know, the kiddos to have something. You know, it's a lot of social distancing. Um, mom, my mums, my regular mums are still being made. I know other people are still making regular mums. But this is an alternative if, um, you know, money can be tight these days. And I get it. And the big mums can be very expensive. So... This still shows school spirit, and that's what we need right now, right guys? Bring it down to the board just a little bit more so that way you can see what I'm doing here. Hi, Missy, how are you? And uh, we'll get this started. If you could be so kind, go ahead and force push me out to your friends and family. I would really appreciate it. I'm gonna bring you down to the board. Oh, I didn't even say, uh, if you get sick, just close your eyes. I'm so sorry. Okay, we're going to get real close. I'm going to try to get real close because um, this is a little, it's not a little project, but it's a little project that we're going to be working on. So, I have a whole bunch of goodies. Um, this is the mask that I use. Like I said, it's disposable. Um, that is notated in my listing if you want to go ahead and purchase. It's a disposable uh, medical mask. So, let me take another sip of coffee. Sorry. I'm actually going to put this off camera so that way I don't spill anything. Hold on. Actually, no. I'm going to need this coffee today. I was going to put it off, but I got a little spot right over here. So, this is for the Ridgecrest Rams in Houston, Texas. And it's for an academic. So, she requested... Um, something in regards to that. Um, she mentioned a, uh, what do you call it? A, um, graduation cap. Just so happens I have one. I use the white sparkles for seniors, but this is perfect for the theme of what her daughter is in. So I'm very happy to be using this one. This one is falling apart. Let me see if I have another one. Hold on. Hold. It looks like the black ones weren't made very well and I'll just go ahead and uh, hot glue it myself. So this is like if you were just hanging out with me on a day. On a day. Whoa, that's a lot of glue. That like came out of there like nobody's business. That's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna let that cool and it's gonna come right off. So it's all glittered. I just want it to be able to stick better. I'm gonna let that cool dry over here. Oh, Hallie! That's offensive to Texas. <laughs> all right. So the way I do the mask itself, I'm kidding, Hallie, I'm kidding. Good morning, Marion. So the colors are navy blue, 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 navy blue and holly green. So I am using, this is called a diamond dust. This is what we normally use on the ribbons um, for the actual mums themselves. And when we do our loops around the mums, so... Um, it, it gives, give, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Um, it gives a little bit of flexibility. Um, so I like to use this and then guys, I'm using ribbon that I have. Okay. This is a Kelly green. It has shimmer and spikle, sparkle. Perfect for homecoming. It's absolutely perfect for homecoming. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Once more of it. So. I'm just measuring the width of the mask. Like I said, this is not, I don't want too much glue on here because I don't want it to be weighed down too much. I'll just take this 
and I'll measure it. And if you guys have questions, please ask. Um, I may not be looking at the screen right now, but I will. And if I miss it, please ask again. Or if I already uh, commented on what I'm doing and somebody heard, they can answer it. I do not mind you asking again. And please don't get upset if I don't answer the first time. It's just I get enthralled on what I'm doing. Okay, so I have the strips. They're about seven inches. Um, they go over uh, just a little bit. That's okay because I am going to um, cut off the edges. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to straighten these edges up. With this, I don't wrap around the, the mask. You see where these seams are? These already are glued and pressed in for the mask itself. And we're, you know, any masks, but... Now I got quiet because I'm like gluing. I'm just gluing down the sides. And I'm not gluing this part. That's where it's, that's where man, mine may be a little bit different. I don't know. I don't know how others are doing their masks. I'm just matching up to the edge and the very bottom. So this is very flexible. I'm not gluing in here, only to the sides. <laughs> only to the sides, okay? I'm gonna do my next one. So I'm just making it stagger because this is kind of see-through. I'm gonna put it right there. Just cutting up the edges. Just cutting up the edges a little bit. So how is everybody's Saturday? Have you eaten breakfast yet? I have not. I have not. I should. I know. Can you make a Halloween? Yes. You can. Now, I cannot sew. Guys, I've said this. I, I don't know how many lives. I cannot sew. My sister is the sewer. Um, when everything started happening, I sent her all my fabric. She's like, Amy, send me everything you have. I'm like, done. And she was able to sew some masks for her residence <clears throat> when she was at Little City. Um, but absolutely, if you have, hold on, let me, that would be fun. Oh my gosh, that would be fun. You know what? I may make some Halloween masks for Danny and I. <laughs> but like I said, these are decorative. These are by no means like the cloth ones. Um, cause this is once you're wearing this once, this is not something, you know, that they're wearing like it's on a daily basis. You know, this is, um, maybe twice during spirit week. Um, schools are different. You know, sometimes they, you know, they only have the kids wearing the moms, um, during the day <clears throat> on this day, or they can only wear it at the homecoming game or where, whatever their rules are. And it's not just because of the coronavirus. It's the squirrels. It, they could just get um, bigger and bigger. And oh, that's not what I meant to do. Come on. Work with me. It's okay. It's okay. See, I'm not putting a lot on. So I can just take it right off. That's what I'm going to do on this side. Because these are already sealed on the sides. Thanks. You could teach me what? To sew? Marion. My sister did try to teach me. So did my grandmother. I sewed things backwards, upside down. I don't, I don't know. But with a hot glue gun, my sister, can. she's afraid of it. She is absolutely afraid of the hot glue gun. Me, I have a love-hate relationship with it. It will always be that way. Oh, there's a helicopter. What's going on? Um... But she, she's absolutely afraid of the hot glue gun. I'm like, you can't let it be one with the glue gun. Don't be afraid. So I'm just going to flip it upside down and make sure that I have that to the edge. Yep. Okay. So when they're wearing it, this is still very comfortable on their face. 
Yes, and Christmas masks, absolutely. Okay, you see where that overhang is? I'm not worried about it. I'm gonna turn it up later. Okay, so this, as you can still, as you can see, it still pulls apart. So it's still very flexible. Now I'm gonna go in with the green. I'm gonna put that stripe of green right on top. This is the same thing. However, we all know that our ribbon has wire in it. And what did I teach you? A little trick, A little trick. I'm taking that wire out. There's already, there's already a wire on the nose bridge. I want this to be as flexible as possible. I'm taking that wire out. Ha ha ha, funny Marion, funny. <laughs> All right. Now this I do a little bit longer because this I am going to over, I'm going to go over the sides. I'm going to show you in just a minute. I just want to make sure that that's in the middle. So you see that stripe and the camera does not do this justice. This is a glitter and this is a sheer, like somewhat glitter. It's fabulous. So what I do is try to turn it over and I make sure it's in the middle between the two elastics. Oh, I need to cut that off first. Do, 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 do. All I'm doing is going down the side, making sure not to cut the elastic, not to cut the mask, and just trimming that up. Silly goofy me. Now. We're gonna bring it in. I just gauge it just a little bit. I'm gonna put my glue. Yes. Come on. Are you gonna work now? Yeah, see, it doesn't take that long at all. I'm gonna put that back on. And all I'm gonna do is fold it over. I just did that little strip of glue right on where the mask is already sealed. Just turning it over, making sure that it's in line, that it's straight, booyah, and just pressing. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. Yes. All right, this is the most tedious part and then the rest is so much fun and it goes really, really fast. Just folding over the sides. Okay. And this one, she is a sophomore. And that's what you get. So now I didn't see it still open, very breathable. I'm going to put a little strip of hot glue right here and right here. So that way it's not flopping around. Right there, but it's still very open. I'm not going to glue down that. That's what we got, making sure, there we go. That's how I cover the masks. My birthday is the seventh. <gasps> Debbie, all my Sagittarius's are in the house today. Pat, whoop whoop, yes. Can I get a whoop whoop for the Saggies? Whoop whoop, whoop whoop. All right, now you have to have bling. I'm sorry, you just have to. If I didn't have bling on the hair, 
that my sales wouldn't, I wouldn't sell. It needs to have bling, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's all about the Texas tradition as well. Now, she's going to have a little bit of bling. It's, um, she's academic, like I said, so she's going to have a little graduation cap. And then they wanted the ram. Oh, what happened to the ram? There it is. They wanted the ram on the actual mask itself. So I got that. I want to do two or one. Bear with me here for just a minute. Let's do two. I'm feeling spunky this morning. So I'm just cutting two lines. You can get this at Hobby Lobby. Um, I think Walmart has this. I think Dollar Tree may have these. Um, I get mine from the wholesaler, but it's just a strip of rhinestones. Rhinestone cowboy. Is that how it goes? <laughs> Yep, bling, lights, everything. Bell, that's right. Thank you for reminding me. I forgot to take out a cowbell. She wants a mini cowbell on here. Guys, I'm telling you. It don't matter. It don't matter. <laughs> We're going to have a cowbell. We're going to have a cowbell. She just wants a mini one. I have mini cowbells. I think I do. I hope I do. I'm going to put on there for her. Oh, there goes that. I'll get it later. So this is way too long. I know. I'm just going to line it. That's all I'm doing. I'm just making it pretty now. This is the fun part. This is where you can start designing. Um, like I said, I make all different ones. She really said, you know, go have fun with it. That's what a lot of the kiddos and the moms say to me. Just have fun with it. I'm like, well, do you want this? Oh, you, <laughs> you decide. I'm like, uh, if I decide, this whole thing will be one big glitter bomb. Which I don't mind. <laughs> they don't mind half the time. Cut, I see it. Cut, 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 cut. Good golly, I'm having, I'm having an eight. There we go. I always cut a little bit longer. Like I said, I'm in no rush. <laughs> I'm in no rush to be doing this. I like to have it done correctly. That one's a little too long. Boy, I was overcompensating on that. Hold, please. And the, the glue that I, the strips of glue that I use are very, very thin. I use Gorilla Glue, so I have no problem with them coming off. Now, when this is a regular mom, <laughs> Tons of glues, tons of staples, but this, I can't do that. So, I have to be mindful of what I put on here. So, like I said, this is all bling. This is going to be a big impact bling. Just a little strip. Right here. And I'm doing it like I would ice, like, oh, jeez. Like you would ice a cake. When you're icing a cake, you do, um, you can continue to do pressure. And then I just set it down. And then I can move it back and forth. I can adjust it where I want it on my mask. I want it to show a little bit of the green. On the side, I'm not worried about this part over here. Make it cool just a little bit, because this is where my mom is going to be. Am I in Jackie's group? Oh, you're talking to Missy. 
I'm in Jackie's group. <laughs> Although she goes down when I'm still working. So always have to catch the replays. So applying the pressure just like you do with icing with icing a cake. That one, that one was a lot better. And then I'm just placing it down. Ooh, this one's gonna be party. Party, 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 party. I don't know if you can see that. Oops, second guess. What? That's what that looks like. Now, the corners need a little something. They need a little something, something. And I'm gonna give them a little something, something. But, at Walmart, um, Hobby Lobby, etc. I'm gonna put those on the four corners because I just finish off the mask a little bit. I think. And they like it. So I'm like, shit. All right. I'll have to send you a picture of mine. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, you were at Jackie's? I told her I'm going to come and uh, raid her ribbon stash. Because good night. Good night, guys. That's like insane. <laughs> her ribbon stash. <laughs> Alright. I only need four. And all I'm going to do is a little bit of glue. Little bit of glue, little bit of glue. I'm just doing that. And all these flyaways, I do the same thing. I just take some um, uh, hair dryer and blow it off. This just finishes it off. You're really not gonna see this one here, but if you're going to do it to the other corners, you better do it to that one. It's just like a child. <laughs> if you have multiple children, if you give one something, you got to give the other one. All right. So that's the mask. That's what we have thus far. I have your PJs on, Julia. <laughs> I love these PJs. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to put this aside really quickly because now I'm going to work on the actual little mum part or the ribbon part. So what I did is I took this that I keep using, just any little cardboard from your ribbons. Um, I keep them. I cut them into quarters just so that way I can gauge um, as to what I'm doing and where I'm going, making sure everything is straight and in line because with the ribbons, um, it's a rule never to have any air showing in. Good morning, Cecile. Good morning, good morning. It, never to have any uh, light or air showing, showing um, behind the ribbons. So everything needs to be just a, just a wall of ribbon and just apparently a wall of glue. <laughs> so... I have my, I wanted to do stars because with academics, I just think of stars, A pluses, etc. What did I do with the, oh, they're right here. Durr. I have a Kelly Green. Um, I used this before. This is acetate, um, high luster, or no, this isn't the luster. This is the holiday green. Um, it's Kelly Green. I'm not measuring these per se. I'm doing about eight inches, but they're going to be cut down. You don't want it too long because it's going to go down the side of the face. You just want something cute. Okay, there's my Kelly Green. Now I'm going to go in. It has to be navy. So I have some navy here. So I have the bling here, I have the bling on the mask, but the ribbons themselves, I'm just gonna 
I'm going to tone it down just a little bit. I'm not really toning it down because I have glitter ribbon right here. And I have the shiny and the glitter in there. <laughs> and then I'm going to put um, 2020 in glitter rhinestone letters. So, <laughs> and when using the, the numbers or letters, it's easier and it, um, they stick better on the acetate rather than uh, anything glittery or the high diamond dust that I used on the mask. So that's why I'm like, I'm going to use it on the mask. And then the rest of this is just going to be on the ribbon. Got the little ram biggity. She's a sophomore. Mams and cowbell. Okay. I don't have a name. So what I'm going to do then is place, let me think, because I may, hold on. Oh yeah, that'll pop right off of there. Never mind, I got it. I'm just layering the ribbon and I'll turn it around so that way you can see it a little bit better. The bottom I'm not too concerned about. I'm just making sure that there's no air. If that makes any sense whatsoever, I know it really doesn't make any sense. The air is like this part right here, any spaces in between. But I think that I'm going to cut up just a little bit. So I'm okay with that down there. Don't want no air. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to take the wire out of these because these have wires too. I take out the wires of all my mom ribbons if I'm using an actual ribbon because I don't want to, I don't want anything to poke. I don't, mm -mm, no. My son is up apparently and rummaging through the kitchen. I can hear him. Hey Ricky. He's going to act like he doesn't hear me now. <laughs> Figures right. You can ignore me all you want. And that's what he's going to do. I can hear him singing him to himself. Let me cut that part right there. Cut. So now I'm just layering it down. See how this is shorter? So it's going to go up. That's what I want. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I hope you guys are enjoying this and having some fun. I know this is not for everybody. This is mainly a Texas thing, but I um, was requested to show how I do them. And I like, you know, when people ask, absolutely. They just didn't give me a name. Um, sometimes I try to do the initial, but that's fine. That's fine. 100% okay with that. So now that I have it lined up, I am going to take the middle. I'm going to fold it over. I'm not going to like squeeze or anything. I am going to cut it the opposite way of what we do when we're doing our tails. I want a point, okay? Because that's going to be the point going down. So now from that point, I am just going to cut up. And the silver is going to be a little bit. So you can see now how it fans out. Come on. There we go. I'm okay with that. Because there's only one staple. I can move it around a little bit if it's not exactly the way I want it. There we go. So that's what it looks like. Okay. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Missy, you need to look up homecoming moms. Texas homecoming moms. This is what we do, but 2020 is different, so 
we are, I'm adjusting to the climate of my clientele and making it a little bit different, a little bit more fun, trying to just, you know, it's been a year already, guys. We know this, okay? Oh, it's too low. Hold on. Hold, please. It's a little too low. Because I did want to put stars there. I forgot I was going to put stars there. How about I put the stars there first? Yeah, I'll do that. See, I get talking and then I forget what I'm doing. Okay, I'll put them on. This is the bottom. I want to do stars. And here's my little cowbell. Hey, whatever they want, right? Whatever they want. Hi, Tammy. How are you? You're not late. We're just, I'm relaxing, you know? I'm relaxing. I'm just showing you how I do these. I'm not in a rush. So if you need to be somewhere, sorry. <laughs> you can always watch the replay. Um, I'm just having fun. And showing you what I do. I don't like to rush these because they are very personal to my kiddos, to the students. And that's really going to upset me that I can't find those stars. Okay, just stop looking for it and it'll come. I can always use these. I can always use these. These are just a little dots that just put a little decorative mm, on, on things. This is just the fun part. It's just decorating. And I know this could get boring and I'm sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Is Sue here yet? Sue asked me if I could do this and I told her I would be on. That, the sticky came off. Did it? Or did it not? No, it didn't. Oh, okay, cool. I thought the sticky came off. I'm just making little accents. Just make it a little cuter. Pam's Fake Bake Bakery. I'm in her group as well. And I'm learning how to do fake bakes. So that's another fun thing. That's a whole different animal. That's like, I'm like, oh yeah, I could do this. I could do that. Yeah. It, it's, it's hard in terms of, you know, starting to do something, but it's a lot of fun. Oh, I do like the little dots better. <laughs> We're just decorating the tails. And then one more, just the 2020. I want to make sure that that's not bulging, if that makes sense. I wanted to make sure that it's in a straight line, all even. There we go. How cute is that? Tammy, they're, they're already have, they have adhesive on them. These, I think I got at Walmart. In the, um, where the ribbons are, where they have their ribbon section. Um, they're in that section. They have adhesive dots, uh, and it already has dots on there. And they stay. Like I said, this adhesive is really good when it's on the acetate ribbon. Okay, so now I'm going to go back in, and I'm going to put the rams where did I put the letters? There it is. Where's my S? There it is. So I'm just going to put this a little bit higher because there's only, well, no, it's Rams. So I'm making sure. I'm OCD when it comes to this. I really, really am. Get my M. 
See, this is just the fun part. This is just a scaled down version of what I would do on a really long, like 34 inch ribbon tail for my mom. Oh, see how sticky they are? They're so sticky. Do I have any on this one? I do. If you're asking me questions, I'll be there in just a minute. And then an R. Do I have an R in this one? No. I'm going to have to go to this one. Ooh, one more R. <laughs> have to get another one. Bye, Hallie! One more letter. Oh, that's not straight. I don't like pulling them back up, but if I need to, I have to. Just go straight. That's so sticky. No, you're not supposed to be up there, Mr. Curly Q. Okay. Yay! I'm happy with that. So they're the Rams. Hi, Lashanta. How are you? If they don't stick well, where's my glue? Hold on. I use this as well. I keep dropping everything. This, because there's some letters that don't stick, like these, do not stick well to the acetate whatsoever. Um, I use this. You're going to want to use this. It's really good. I'm sorry. What happened? Am I getting a call? I don't mean to be getting a call. Okay, cool. Whew. It said it interrupted. I'm like, oh no. So that's the glue that I use. Um, by all means, they sell that at Walmart as well. Sorry, you're seeing my butt. <laughs> um, they sell it at Walmart and it's just awesome. I've never had a problem with the letters uh, coming off when I use this or any like little um, doodads. So if you're still having issues, get this. Awesome, I love this. I swear by this on my mom's. And it dries clear, which is awesome. You know, Mod Podge says it dries clear. Uh-uh, no. <laughs> That's not true to an extent. All right, so I'm done with my letters. I know, Amy. Stop talking! Just craft show! Okay. Let me put all of the letters over here so they're out of the way. Now on the floor. Okay. So, now let me get my little mom. We have all of this done, and I'm just going to press. I'm going to flip it over and just press them just to make sure they're on there. But it's really sticky adhesive. I don't have an issue with it. Okay, now I'm just going to cut this down. When I say I'm going to cut it down, I'm going to cut it so it's just like a little piece. Uh, just a little piece for me to glue onto that mask. Once again, we don't want anything heavy, but I want something. And I could have just um, stapled the, you know, the ribbons together, but this just gives me a better backing to it. Okay, the mums I use are three-inch mums. And you can get these on Amazon. You can get them if you're in Texas. Um, Hobby Lobby always has them. They're just really cute. That's a little mum. I always put a pipe cleaner through it. So that way, because mums are like any flower. They're done in sections. 
and you don't want these suckers to fall apart on you. So when I put the pipe cleaner through, I'm going to take off this green stem right here. Okay. We don't need that. I'm going to pull it through. We don't need this part over here. All this goes in the trash. I haven't figured out what I can use those for yet, so <laughs> they go in the trash. Good morning, Jackie. We were just talking about you and I'm rating your, um, whatchamacallit, your uh, ribbon. <laughs> go into your house because Missy said she was over there, I think. I missed some of the comments because I was creating. <laughs> So now I just put a little knot, I'm going to put it through, and I'm going to put a little dab of glue in there. Just a dabber. A dabber do ya. I know I keep going off camera, but my glue gun is over here, and I'm sitting down. I need a chair like Jackie has. Okay? And then I'm going to cut off. Boop. I don't need all of this. I saved this. And I use it on another project. Now, with my mums, I normally do loops and there's a backing and they're really, really pretty. Once again, I can't have it too heavy. So, tinsel. I love tinsel. Tinsel, 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 tinsel. Um, I have found that, hi, CD that um, after Christmas, I am getting a whole bunch of this because this works so well on so many different things with mums. So this is a three inch, it's kind of small. The hat is kind of big, okay? I'm just, I made a circle. This is one that I already made from a couple days ago and then I decided not to use it on one mum. Um, I'm just gonna feed it through so it makes it look bigger and it's gonna be pretty on there. That's all I'm doing. That's all I'm doing. Okay. And if you're hopping on in, hello, welcome. I'm Amy Rose with Amy Rose Craft Studio. We're making a homecoming mom mask. Um, these are decorations for the kiddos here in uh, Texas. That's true, Jackie, yes. <laughs> now, this is the first time somebody has requested a cowbell. I need to figure out how I'm going to incorporate this into the mum face mask. I haven't done that before. Okay, I know that's good. <laughs> I like that noise. Sorry, guys. I think it's fun. Um, so let me figure out. See, this is what I do. This is me. When I get an order for one of these or my mom's, this is how I try to figure things out. I know she wants it to dangle. I may just put it on a ribbon. I think it'll just be easier to do it that way. I'm trying, I don't want it to pull down the mask. That's my biggest thing. It's my biggest thing. Yo. Hold on, I still like this idea. So if I put it here, it'll still dangle. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna do it that way. <laughs> but you know what? I'm gonna do this last because I need to glue that on. Sorry. Squirrel! Squirrel, squirrel, squirrel. I'm just putting some hot glue around that mom. I know you can't see. My hot glue gun is over here. Just putting it around. And now I'm taking this and going right through it. Trying not to burn myself. And then smashing the holy bejesus out of it. 
Jackie, I'm gonna do, um, it's, she wants a, like a, a graduation hat. She's not a senior, she's a sophomore, but she's in, um, the academics. So she wanted the hat on there. So I'm gonna put the hat and then the ram. Where's the ram? I keep losing the ram. I think I'll put the ram on the actual mum itself over here, or on the mask. Or I may put it in here. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Hi, Hallie. Welcome back. Jackie, did you, do you have moms in your states? I didn't have, I'm from Illinois. And when I got to Texas and I started doing, you know, my wreaths and everything, and somebody asked me, do you do moms? I'm like, what's a mom? <laughs> what the heck's a mom? And I had to look it up because we didn't have that. Okay. Hold on. Let me see if this works really quickly. Oh yeah, you'll be able to see it. So you'll be able to see it underneath. Just a hint and it'll shake. <laughs> shake, shake, shake. Yes, Tammy. Yes, 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 yes. I did a huge one before, it was nuts, okay. I need to put this ribbon over here because I need to get my glue gun because now it's time to start attaching things. So all I'm going to do is lift this up and I'm going to glue it right here on the diamond dust. Okay, so that way this is still breathable. Like I said, it's decoration. This is not meant to be anything but. I don't want no haters. Are you serious, Jackie? Girl, do you do mums? If not, I'll hook you up. I'll do all of them for you. <laughs> I did not know that. See, Illinois did not have this, this tradition. It really doesn't. Okay. Let me get my hot glue gun. Put it down here. Just a little bit. Opening up that pocket and putting it in. Just making sure my mom. Oh, that's cute. That's so cute. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I do this with all my moms, guys. <laughs> I love making them. Even though I didn't get the honor of having this tradition in my home state, I love making them. I absolutely adore it. Yeah, right? <laughs> you just don't know. <laughs> I absolutely adore making them. I really, really do. Okay, just making sure that that's, you know, that's in there. There we go. Still very flexible. Okay. Come on now. Oh, I'm sorry. There. Okay. So now I'm going to put in my little mom right here, right on top, like where it should be. Like here, it would have just like ribbons all over the place. Really cute. Nah, we can't do that here. We cannot do that here. So I'm just gonna take glue right there, just a little bit. I'm not using a lot. And you may think that this side of the mask is going to be heavy and weighed down. It's really not. It's really, really not. I promise you. Promise, I promise you. Cause we still have this to go in there. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be fun. Okay. 
Oh, that's true. That's true with the florists. Like a lot of um, cheer, they'll do kits. And I try not to take away from that, but like the ROTC here at Wagner, um, right by us, they reached out to me and they said, hey, <laughs> can we? And I'm like, absolutely. <laughs> Do it. All right. So that's there. Now I'm thinking, do I really want this big hat on there? Or do I want... No, I think that's cute. Because I can put a little homecoming right here somewhere with all my stuff. Hold on guys, I'm playing. This is what I do. This is what I do. Oh, I love that. I love that so much. This ram, she wants a ram in here. This is messing up my whole... <sighs> I could have had the ram peeking out. But I did put rams. Hold on. Did she say mascot or just incorporate? Our mascot is rams. You know what? She didn't say. Yeah, that's true. That's so, so true. That's everywhere. I don't know if I want to put that ram in there. Okay, I'm going to leave it out. I'm going to take a picture of it when I'm done. And if she still wants it, I'll put it in. But I really, I think she's going to be in awe of the, the graduation hat that I'm putting on here. trying to see which way I want to do it. I think I want to do it that way. So I'm just designing as I go. Real life, people. Real life. Have an idea. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. <laughs> I'm not going to sit here and cry about it. Oh, which way did I have it? This way. Hold the hat in there. The hat is really, really light. Oh, I guess. I don't know. I don't like it. <laughs> because Beverly she is an acad she's under the um let me say it correctly because i don't want it um to come off like incorrect or whatever but the school activities is generic academics um so she requested a graduation cape or cap or similar um because she's in academic programs so i'm assuming like math club she's very in you know, like uh, national honor society etc I could be wrong. I could be talking, you know, out my wazoo. However, this is what she requested. Now, the seniors, my senior moms, get the white hats. This, I just happen to have a black one. And I'm like, that's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. Just making sure that this is all sticky. That's what we have thus far. I have the homecoming arch that I'm going to put this way, I think. Yeah. Hold on. Bram. Mm. It seems like there's a lot that it's heavy on this side, but it's not. When you pick it up, it is a little bit heavier on this side, but it doesn't weigh it down. Honors. Correct. I couldn't think of that word. I'm like, blah, blah, blah. what are these in? So 
So the home, oh, see, I don't have everything on. Oh, I can stand it up. So the homecoming bridge will be, I don't have a straight, I do have a straight um, instead of the curved homecoming, but that comes right across and you won't be able to bend it. So I like the curve. So I just put the little bit of hot glow on the homecoming, I put it on the edge, it's cooling off, and I'm just going to put it in the mum, I'm just going to nestle it in there, give it a little shake, you know when you're doing your um, grapevines and florals and everything. Give it a little shake a shake. Make sure that it's in there. I'm going to put this back on the charger. I want to put something here. I may put a star. I may hot glue it right there so that way it stays. Not sure about the ram. However, this is done. I'm going to take a picture for my customer and see how she likes it. But that is what my homecoming mom mask is. I'm going to put it like here and then maybe the star over here and I'll put it in different areas and see where she wants it to be placed. Let me put it up a little higher so that way you can see. Oh, pfft. see, that ram doesn't even want to be on the mom. All right. Y'all are in Kentucky. <laughs> I want to be in Kentucky. That's it. I like the star, I think, of academics. I think the stars and everything. Look at my hair. Look at the mom. Look at the mom. This is what we we're doing today. <laughs> If you missed it, you're just coming in late. This will be on for replay. I want to thank you for spending your Saturday morning with me. If you do have any other questions or you're trying to do this and you can't figure something out, please PM me. I'll be more than happy to help you. I will put my phone on the charger uh, to charge it up. I think today, once Danny gets up, we're going to go ahead and thank you so much, Missy. I appreciate that. Um, we're going to do some Halloween decorating and I may go live while doing some, uh, decorating. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know yet. I have an idea for a cauldron that I want to do. I did a whole skeleton in the bathtub cauldron last year and I did ribbon. So it looked like, you know, the towel, um, coming up, but I, I, I think I have another idea. So we'll see. All right, guys, I'm done talking. Please PM me if there's any questions. Uh, thank you again for joining me. So long, farewell, Alvina, say an adieu, adieu, adieu to you and you and you who enjoy your Saturday, please. Be kind, be friendly, be healthy, be safe. Wash your hands. <laughs> Bye, guys. Mwah. Love you. Have a great, great Saturday. Bye.